this is a unicycle for those of you who don't know what it is. <laughs> yeah. This is a unicycle. And this is the device that I use to connect the unicycle with the Commodore 64. But before doing that demo, I'm going to show you a game that I did for, for Convex, which is the Uni Games. It's a unicycle game. There it says unijoystical compatible. This is the main menu. I'm going to start game. First I'm going to play with the joystick and start game. And I'm going to select it has three events, road race, cyclocross, and cross country. Yeah. Let's do road race. One or two players you can play against the computer or another rider. So let's say player and this is like any you know any other game where you have to do like this. I think I that's in the bottom part of the screen, yeah? The top is the computer and I'm in the bottom part. And I have to do it like this, yeah? Da -da 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 -da. This is like summer games or you know where you have to break your noise. slow down my rider, so I'm the guy in the bottom part, so if I press it jumps. So I press, let me jump.
So I can play basically any game with this, uh, with my phone, you know, because it's a real D-pad. I, I have fire, all the dial, all the up, down, left, and right, and I can emulate either joystick, joystick one or joystick two. But it has another mode, which is called the uni joystick mode. And this is the fun part, yeah? Where it reads, it reads the accelerometer from the phone, and it actually reads the angle, because it has it reads the C and Y accelerometer, which is doing a kind of sign, sign thing, so I'm calculating the angle, yeah? So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the phone under the pedal. tape, Ricardo. Oh, we have oh. stronger tape. Yeah. We have, uh, uh, it's, I think it's... We have stronger tape. Can I finish the demo? <laughs> okay. And they got... Hello. Oh, gosh. Well, I think it will survive. Oh. <laughs> so, for this one, so I don't want to break my phone again. Oh, ish. Oh. oh, come on. Yeah, I will do a stronger type of <laughs> Oh, 
Questions for Ricardo. Questions. Did you write the uh, debug app on the phone? Yes. Yeah, I, uh, it was a kind of a fun project for me to do everything. So I wrote the game. It's in assembly. I designed the the, the board and I wrote the, firm, the firmware and the application for the for the phone. Does it have to be on a unicycle or can you like to use one of those old uh, hill climbing bikes? Well, it wouldn't be as fun, I think. Safer though. Especially for the phone. But Pogo, yeah. Next to Pogo stick, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. It should, it should work. Are you thinking of um, making this into an Amiga game so Amigans yeah. can play with it? Everything is open source and open hardware. <laughs> I do not have an Amiga, never, <laughs> never had one, but if there's an Amiga guy here who wants to board it, yeah, oh. <laughs> Go for it, Robert. No, no. Just stay off the unit. <laughs> Any other questions for Ricardo? Are you tired? <laughs> <laughs> Is this for all your exercise, daily exercise? <laughs> no, but I think it will be. <laughs> How are you? Uh, 42. 43. Oh, you're 43. Working. I'm going to guess you're in your 20s. Me too. <laughs> thank you. Okay, thank you, Ricardo. Thank, thank you very much. Yay!